Just eight kilometres off the North Queensland coast near Townsville in Australia lies Magnetic Island, an island paradise positioned in the Great Barrier Reef Marine Park, Australia's most popular cruising location. 320 days of sunshine a year make this part of the world a great place to visit. Just 80 minutes by air from Brisbane, Townsville is a very accessible city, surrounded by idyllic beaches and abundant marine life. After a short trip on sun ferries from Townsville, you'll arrive at the Peppers Blue on Blue Resort, the venue for the 2008 Sun Ferries Magnetic Island Race Week. The location of Magnetic Island means the sailing conditions on the surrounding waters vary from those found at the Whit Sundays. Event director Dennis Thompson explains. Magnetic Island is a bit further west, northwest of um, the Whit Sundays, so we're not so much in the trade wind flow here. Uh, the normal breeze would be an easterly, turning northeasterly with um, at this time of the year with a sea breeze. The Sun Ferries Magnetic Island Race Week is scheduled one week after the Hamilton Island Race Week, perfectly timed for the 90 nautical mile voyage north. This year the race week attracted a much larger fleet. Racing divisions for the 2008 regatta includes performance handicap, cruising non-spinnaker, cruising with spinnaker and the prestigious IRC Racing. In the IRC Racing division, local boat Zoe took the win putting the ghosts of 2007 well behind her and setting the record straight after last year's narrow loss. Wayne Miller and the crew had their work cut out for them, with the challenge from the high-tech wide that finished the regatta with smiles on their faces. The potential for, for racing here is as good as Hamilton Island, if not better. You know, the, the marina's ready, the, the island's ready, the resort's ready. Um, you know, we went from 23 boats last year to 35 this year, so it's a 50% increase already. It was a valiant tilt at the title for Guilty Pleasures, who missed the overall win by just 70 seconds in the last race. Good performances on the earlier passage races give Aussie Rules the cruising non-spinnaker division title. Michelle Petrie's Beneteau 57 Knack Knack close in second, and Barbarella wins the cruising with spinnaker division. In the PHS division, the boat takes a surprise win. The much fancied Wild Spirit just makes the top five. And only its second year, the Sun Ferries Magnetic Island Race Week has the look of a well-established regatta and has quickly come up to speed with the other regional regattas, all run at the perfect time of the year. With the resort facilities, marina and race management all getting five-star ratings, this event will quickly become a must-do regatta on the Australian winter circuit. I think it's a, it's a great location to, to hold something like this with the you know, blue on blue right on the marina itself and uh, right out the front with the whales and the, and the, you know, the picturesque uh, hills and stuff. So yeah, I'm, I'm pretty happy with where it is and happy with what's happened this year. The laid-back tropical atmosphere of Magnetic Island gives this regatta a distinct point of difference from regattas held at the same time of the year in the Northern Hemisphere. It's the complete cruising experience in a truly magical setting. It will all happen again from the 4th to the 8th of September 2009 and details can be found on the Magnetic Island Race Week website.